Attorney General Dana Nessel says she wants her Solicitor General and the Wayne County Prosecutor's Office working together on Flint's criminal cases over the water crisis. Attorney General Dana Nessel says the investigation into Flint's water crisis has not only continued, but intensified under her leadership, revealing that she plans to have her Solicitor General, Fadwa Hamoud, and Wayne County Prosecutor Kim Worthy work together on Flint's water criminal cases moving forward. It was really important for us to have people working on these cases that were actually accountable to this office and accountable directly to the people of this state. According to the Attorney General, they have 79 civil cases and eight active criminal cases involving the water crisis. However, the Attorney General says she'll be handling the civil cases only, leaving those criminal cases in the hands of her Solicitor General, Fadwa Hamoud, a decision Hamoud says she is prepared for. Building a team right now, uh, there are over 4 million documents, along with other pieces of evidence associated with this case. Hamoud also says this case will be about the people of Flint first, and firmly agrees with the Attorney General's stance to remove the use of a contracted attorney. I come into this role with concern for the victims of the public health crisis in the city of Flint. And my only preconceived notion deals with whether or not the people of Flint were wronged here. They were. Now, as for former Special Prosecutor Todd Flood, who headed Flint's water criminal cases under Attorney General Bill Schutte, well, he has been appointed to Special Assistant Attorney General and will be working alongside Hamoud as well. Reporting live in the Continuous News Center, Jonathan Jackson, WNEM-TV5.